first time at the range, I was excited. Gats, four fives, and nines, I wanted to know what all the hype was about. So I walked up to the counter, ready to flex my second amendment. I picked out a target, a 2D representation of ops I've never seen. I see a gun I like, a few actually. Rifles to pistols, I wanted to try them all out. I wanted to know what it felt like on the other side of the barrel. I remember as a young boy, when my curiosity got the better of me, I played with sticks and toys and fought off the demons in my imagination. These young boys out here playing with sticks and toys and fighting off demons in their reality, their curiosity didn't kill the cat. It killed somebody's dog, though, tragic, so I'm at the range. Sorting through all the options. Getting a feel for each weapon that piqued my interest, trying not to offend anyone in this room full of law-abiding citizens. It seems that guns are allowed in only the safest of places, I think to myself. Scopes and attachments, which one of these lenses would give me a new perspective? Do I have to turn it to a side for a different point of view? Is this cool? Short clip or long mag for a small problem, the former should fit you. The latter is best used if you have multiple issues in a hood with multiple ops and rising tensions. It's only natural them young boys prefer extension, so I'm at the range. Target up and ready to be gunned down in cold blood. Pistol in my hand, cold and heavy. As I focused in those, on, in those, as I focused in on those iron sights, the target became a blur. I wonder if them boys saw the same. If they knew they were targets too. To all those under God, they are just sinners singing each other to the devil for the hell of it. To me, just brethren, when it's beef, them boys even weaponized food, you know, banana clips and potatoes on a barrel for the side dish, all this to put dinner on the table. When you sandwich so many together, of course they see bread as their only way out at the bar or behind them. You can either die drinking an old fashioned or from old fashioned bullets. They both came straight from the barrel, so I'm at the range. Safety off and nose pointed at everything that would become my business. I squeezed the trigger. Over and over and over and over and over and over again until bullets no longer sprang forth. Until silence, the only thing that followed the hammer strike. And then thoughts, like damn, that was easy. I hope them boys and think the same. That's that piece.